Guys, today we're judging books. Not on their cover, but whether or not they can stop a 308. All right, we've got about 40 novels, and we're gonna shoot them with increasing calibers to see how many books it takes to stop them. Chapter one, 22 long rifle. Tipman, M422. Okay guys, our 22 impacted right here, and my daddy was a pistol and I'm a son of a gun. We went through six books and ended up in Janet Evanich's Wicked Apples on page, ah, on page 266, there's our slug. Diesel glanced over at me. Is that a possibility? No. Nine millimeter. Glock 45. Guys, our nine mil hit right here in our first book, and believe it or not, this went through six books as well, stopping in the same Wicked Apples. And page 192 here, there's our nine mil slug. I'm guessing it was the other way around. Probably snatched, Lenny said. 45 ACP, standard manufacturing, 1911. Okay guys, our 45 hit right there, and this went through one, two, three, four, and got stuck in High Treason, our fifth book. That's our 45 slug right there. High Treason is investigative journalism at its best. 300 blackout. The Butter Ferret. Okay guys, 300 blackout hit right there. It went through eight books, got stuck in our ninth, Jill Jones' Circle of the Lily. And here's our 300 blackout slug. That's a little hot. He will somehow escape the curse that plagues this family. Please don't ask for a divorce. 556. Five, Daniel Defense. Mark 12. All right, our 556 five, entered right there. And this one went through 14 books, guys. Uh, stopped in 15, or I should say passed through 15. This one started yawing and ended up going into the table right there. 308. Palmetto State Armory. Jackal 10. All right, guys, our 308 entered right there, right on the and. And this thing went through 17 books. This is where our last trail of it was seen. Looks like it started curling up and took out the top of Stephen Law's ghost train and went sailing into the berm. Guys, I'd love to recommend this book to you, but far too many holes in the plot for me. Don't forget, at 50,000 subs, we will unlock the 50 cal for the channel. Also want to thank the Firearms Policy Coalition for sending us some swag to rep here on the channel. They are a zero compromise gun rights organization fighting for our second amendment liberties. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Pants out.